Welcome to Unite's product knowledge. I've been in the industry for 40 years and understand how hair works and how hair reacts to different products. So 15 years ago, I decided to start Unite. And what we've done with Unite is created, I think, the perfect balance of products for any texture of hair. And what we're gonna to do today is take you through the different families that we have within the Unite brand. And so you can figure out which hair type you have and which product in the Unite brand will actually work for you. So let's start with the products and let's go through them and see what your product is. To note three ingredients that we haven't added to our products. One, parabens. What's a paraben? Paraben is a preservative which is heavier and waxier and it's not what we want in our products. So what do we use instead? We use food grade preservatives. Second ingredient that we haven't added is sulfates. Sulfates can be a little harsher when cleansing the hair and can fade color very, very quickly. So we use mild cleansing agents derived from coconut. And then the third ingredient that we haven't added is sodium chloride is a salt. We don't have that added to any of our products. Why is it used? It can be used as a cheap thickening agent, but the other thing that it does that we don't like, it reverses a keratin straightening treatment that's been done in the hair or any kind of relaxing service that's been put in the hair as well. So starting with the first family of products that we have, it's seven seconds. Seven seconds is ready for intense moisture in the hair. Hair that's sort of been a little bit neglected maybe, uh, especially mid-lengths to the ends. Something that needs repairing a little bit more. The great thing about seven seconds as well is we're adding moisture to the hair and we're repairing the hair, but it's weightless. We're not looking at ingredients that weigh the hair down or we're not looking at ingredients that are going to coat the hair and make the hair feel heavy. So when you're working with the seven seconds line, make sure that you work with the full line because the full line is going to give you more of a benefit. Seven second shampoo, moisturizing shampoo that cleanses the hair using a base cleansing agent derived from coconut. That coconut cleansing agent is very mild and very soft on the hair, but adds moisture to it as well. Seven seconds conditioner is obviously in the seven seconds family working with the shampoo. One thing that you'll find with the conditioner is it's extremely moisturizing without any weight. It's not a weighty product. It won't weigh your hair down. So make sure that you do use the conditioner with the shampoo. Even if you feel a little bit worried about your hair being finer and your hair is going to be a little bit heavier, it won't be with the seven seconds conditioner. So make sure you use this with the shampoo. Now, one of our key successes to the whole line that we have is the seven seconds leave-in conditioner. This is probably your best friend that you'll ever have when it comes to working with your hair. It's an incredible UV protector, thermal protector, and an amazing detangler. So if you have any chemicals in your hair, highlighted, relaxed, um, color in general through the hair, this is perfect for it. Now, one thing that you have to remember with this is a lot of people think that a leave-in conditioner is gonna weigh their hair down, make their hair feel weighty. This is completely weightless. You can use this on the finest of hair and have no challenge with blow drying the hair or even letting the hair dry naturally and have no feeling of weight in it whatsoever. Seven seconds is a must. You can use this with any of our families whatsoever, laser straight, booster, or seven seconds. But again, the leave-in conditioner, no weight whatsoever, but amazing properties in it that you need for your hair. Remember, UV protector, thermal protector, and an amazing detangler. If you find that your hair needs that little bit more conditioning, that you've been out in the sun a little bit too much, or again, neglected the hair, a treatment from the seven seconds family will be the best thing for you. How often would you use this treatment? Depending on the damage of your hair or the neglect of your hair with the condition of it, you might want to use it once a week at first, leaving it in for 10 to 15 minutes, working it through the mid lengths to the ends. After you feel that your hair is starting to get a little bit more repaired and feeling a little bit more moisturized and healthy, 
Try using it every other week. But again, still leaving it in for about 10 to 15 minutes. But in the beginning, if your hair has been neglected, use it once a week. That's the seven seconds treatment. When we work on to blow drying your hair, and if your hair has been damaged or your hair needs a little bit more moisture, a couple of things that are very important when you're blow drying. You want to have a product in your hair that again, works with the thermal protection, but also holds the blow dry shape that you want for at least a day or two. So we have seven seconds blow dry cream. Work this through the hair all the way, just literally below the roots through to the ends. Make sure that you get even distribution by combing it through once you've put it into the hair. Once you've got the even distribution, start to blow dry. You can rough dry the hair at first to get most of the moisture out of it and then start working with a brush. What you'll find with the seven seconds blow dry cream is you'll still have moisture and movement in your hair, but your blow dry will last you a lot longer than it usually does, at least an extra day. Then when it comes to getting a bit more shine in the hair, maybe hair that's lacking moisture, usually needs a little bit more reflection and more shine. We have seven seconds glossing spray. Perfect, a light spray over the top. Hold the can about five or six inches away from the hair, spray gently throughout and get a nice sheen. What this also does, it will literally make the hair reflect the light a lot more and you'll get an amazing sheen through your hair. That's just to finish off, especially if your ha hair is lacking a little bit of moisture. Now, sometimes when we have hair that is lacking moisture, we don't want to shampoo it twice a day, maybe not every day either. What do we do in that situation? We use our seven seconds refresher, which is like a dry shampoo, but we call it our seven seconds refresher. What you want to do with this is and make sure that you do this, We've put a ball bearing in the can so the translucent powder inside is broken up even more. Make sure when you work with this, tap the can to get the ball bearing moving in the can. Shake quite vigorously to make sure that that ball bearing breaks down the powder which is translucent. And then when you work this through the hair, make sure that you spray it at the root and literally slightly up the hair shaft from the root. And let me just show you how this works. Spray it into the hair, and as you can see with the palm of my hand, there is absolutely no white residue or powder on that. That's because the powder that we use in the seven seconds refresher is translucent, so you can't see it. Perfect for all hair shades. Now, that's our seven seconds line, which again, you will use on hair texture from fine, medium to thick that needs a little bit more moisture and a little bit more taken care of. So now we're going to look at the Boing family, which is obviously for curly hair, slightly textured hair that you want to create more curl within that hair. And we've got the full line here and this is what you would use if your hair has that curl texture through it. Starting off with the shampoo and conditioner. Again, cleansing agents derived from coconut, but we've used a little bit more coconut oil in here because we want to create a lot of moisture in the hair. We almost want the ingredients in the products that we've got here, which they are, to be hygroscopic, which means it's going to attract moisture to the hair to keep that defined curl working through it. So, Boing shampoo um, for that curl texture hair, amazing to work with, with the conditioner as well keeping that moisture in the hair, but defining your curl fairly quickly. We also have a leave-in conditioner. And for any of you out there that have got naturally curly hair, it usually tends to be a little bit coarse. And what happens with naturally curly hair or textured hair, it doesn't reflect the light as well as straighter hair does, obviously for reasons of the reflection on the curl of the hair. So, We've worked with hydrolyzed rice protein along with some coconut oils in our leave-in conditioner to close the cuticle down as quickly as possible to be able to get a smoother finish that reflects the light to get shine in your curly hair. Also make it a lot more manageable as well when you're trying to comb through the hair, brush through the hair and get that conditioner to work on the hair to really get it sealing 
the cuticle and sealing those ends. So once you've worked with that leave-in conditioner in your hair, again, to seal the cuticle down, you might want to work with the Moisture Curl Cream. This is for the hair texture that has a defined curl in it, the hair texture that doesn't fall quickly. This is for that curl in the hair that just needs a little bit more moisture, more hydroscopic, which means it's attracting moisture to the hair to keep that curl in it. This does not have any hold properties. So once again, if you've got that naturally curly hair that falls into the curl, what you're gonna to wanna to do is define the curl a little bit more, seal it, and you can do that with our Boing Moisture Curl Cream. Now if you've got the hair texture where the curl might tend to drop a little bit more, we have another product for that in the styling finishing line of the Boing, which is the Boing Defining Curl. What this will do, it will help the definition of the curl, hold that curl in a little bit longer, but without that crispy, crunchy feeling that you get sometimes from styling agents. So if your hair tends to drop a little easier and you need to just hold that curl in or define that curl a little bit more, Boing Defining Curling Cream is the best for you. Again, working with all five products, depending on your hair texture, but this is the best thing for naturally curly hair or textured hair that you want to create more definition. So everyone that's looking for volume in their hair, the perfect family for that is the Booster family. And we have the Booster Shampoo Conditioner, Thickening Cream, and the Volumizing Spray. Let's go through them one by one so you can understand how they work. Natural polymers are worked into the Booster Shampoo, which will literally create volume in your hair while it's being shampooed and cleansed as well. Now, I know that sounds a little funny, how does that happen? But actually, while we're cleansing the hair, we're starting to plump the hair up a little bit, which I think is very important. So it's the base of what you need as you work through to creating the volume. Then working through with our booster conditioner, a um, couple of the main ingredients in here that are important are Panthenol B5, which is a really great thickener for the hair. So while we're conditioning the hair, moisturizing the hair, making the hair feel really good, we're also starting to plump the hair up and get a little bit more volume through the hair at the same time. So these two products will be the base of creating the volume in your hair. Now, if your hair is quite fine and you really want to increase that volume through it, I recommend working with Booster Thickening Cream. And let me try and explain to you how this actually works. We've got vegetable-based moisturizers, and what they do is they tend to work through into the hair, and then we wrap the hair to seal those in on the outside with the thickening cream. So as the hair is blow-dried through here, you've got this literal encasing of that thickening moisturizer, which is gonna give the hair that boosted volume through it. And as you blow dry through it, it just increases and increases the volume. Again, you're not gonna feel weight in this. You're gonna feel as though your hair has just been lifted up with that booster type of a feeling. Perfect for mid lengths through the ends. I wouldn't tend to take it all the way down to the root, maybe just above the root area, but mid lengths and the ends is perfect for it. So working with Booster Volumizing Spray, one of my favorite products, because you create volume in the hair, but you also still have movement. A Couple of ingredients in here that are important to note. Sea kelp and hydrolyzed castor oil, which is castor oil, which is a very, very fine molecule with water built around it as well. So what that does, it creates the volume in the hair, but still has the weightlessness, so the hair can still move, and it's not flat and weighed down. So, Booster Volumizing Spray, I would hold about five to seven inches away from the hair, spray all through the hair, mid lengths, ends especially, and then blow dry through, creating a lot of volume with weightless movement. A little bit more intensity with the volume and thickening, go with the Booster Thickening Cream. But that is the Booster line to create volume in your hair and perfect for anybody that wants to create that boosted feeling throughout the hair. When working with the Laser Straight family, this is perfect for hair that's coarser, has a little bit of texture to it, 
and you as a client want to get that hair smoothed out and keep it smooth for as long as you can. So working with the laser straight shampoo, what we tried to do with this and we've achieved it, is to be able to get the cuticle sealed as quickly as possible and make sure that that cuticle stays sealed, sealing the moisture in, which is what we want, but also stopping any moisture from getting into the cuticle to make the hair create texture in it again. Then working obviously with the conditioner, which you work with them hand in hand, the conditioner's got some great ingredients in it. Things that we want to think about that how are these working with smoothing the hair out and working with them. So ingredients that we're going to look at in the laser straight conditioner are argan oil, which we know is phenomenal for keeping the hair in great condition, but the oil is going to help smooth the hair out. Shea butter, which again is extremely moisturizing, but again is going to help to get the smoothness through the hair. And then we've got some sunflower seed oil through here as well. What this is going to do is going to keep that moisture in, but the biggest thing that we want with getting the coarseness and the texture out in the hair is being able to use moisture to smooth the hair out. And that's what we've achieved with laser straight shampoo and conditioner. Once you've worked with the laser straight shampoo and conditioner, then we're going to move on to the laser straight relaxing fluid. Menifomate is one of the ingredients in here that's really going to help get that hair smoothed out very, very quickly. We've also got panthenol, um, derived from vitamin B and tocopherol, which is vitamin E. And both of those really help work the texture out of the hair, work the curl out of the hair, and create smoothness and straightness through the hair very, very quickly. The other thing that we decided with Laser Straight was we didn't want the hair to go very flat. So we've made sure that even if you're blow drying your hair straight, you're stretching that curl out to create smoothness through it, you won't have flat hair either. This still will have some beautiful movement and a little bit of volume in the hair as well. So, Laser Straight is what you'll follow on with from the Laser Straight Shampoo and Conditioner, the Laser Straight Relaxing Fluid. A small component to our line is the U Luxury Shampoo and Conditioner. And we searched around the world for some really key ingredients in a shampoo and conditioner that are very, very beneficial to the hair. And in our U Luxury shampoo and conditioner, we have Oregon oil, which we use in some of our other products in the line, but we've also used crushed pearl as a strengthening agent in the shampoo, and white honey, which comes from the big island of Hawaii, which is fantastic for creating volume in the hair and replenishing hair and helping hair in its growth. So the U Luxury line is very unique in itself, but something that's a little bit different to the line, but perfect for a client that wants the everyday shampoo with a little bit more luxury. So when we're working with blonde hair, highlighted hair, bleached hair, high lift blondes, it's always nice to make sure that you keep that blonde perfect. What do we have for that? We have the Blonder family. Starting with the Blonder Shampoo. Blonder Shampoo is a toning shampoo. So any brassiness that you might get with your blonde, any yellowing that you might have through the tips, this will take that out. Now, can you use it every day? Absolutely. I have obviously natural hair, it's not colored at all, but I use this every day because I want to make sure that my gray stays true and gray and doesn't go yellow either. So again, using this on your blonde, Highlighted, high lift blondes, anything like that to take the brassiness out, the yellowness out, this will do that. Can you use it every day? Absolutely, depending on how porous your hair is. I would suggest maybe using it two, three times a week and then utilizing the other shampoos in our family in between that. But you can use this every day if you wish to. But again, if you start to get that little bit of yellowing or tarnishing on the end of your blondes, the perfect shampoo to use for it. Now, don't be frightened when you actually see the product. It is purple in its color, um, and that's what actually tones the yellowness or the brassiness out. This will not stain your hair, it will tone your hair as it shampoos as well. And again, it won't leave residue on the floor, in the shower, anything like that, it washes away. Trust me, using it every day, I know how it works. Secondly, you want to work with our Blonder Conditioner. 
This will seal the tone in. It will again moisturize the hair like a conditioner. It has a very, very light tone to it when you look at it. This will not tone your hair, but it will seal the tone in, which has been done from the blonder shampoo. So again, high lift blondes, light tinted hair, bleached hair, the perfect combination, blonder shampoo and blonder conditioner. We suggest that once a week that you use a clarifying shampoo, um, obviously from build up from maybe products that you might have used if you're layering them a lot, or just the environment. There's certain things in the environment that will build up on your hair as well. So we work with the Weekender shampoo. A couple of things in this that we want to look at. One of those ingredients in here is Tridoseth, which literally stops any buildup on the hair. So any buildup that you could get throughout the week is gonna block that and stop that from happening. We've also got rice and vegetable protein in here, which strengthens the hair while we're cleansing it at the same time as well. I would tend to use this definitely, like I mentioned before, once a week. Leave it on for a couple of minutes once it's shampooed and lathered in your hair, and then rinse out and condition as usual. But weekend of shampoo, definitely use that once a week. So working into our styling agents now, little extra different styling products that we've got, little family of styling. Put in the hair when the hair's wet, blow dried through or left to dry naturally. So starting off with the first product, it's Expander Volume. And the way this works is it's aimed at the root, sprayed on the root and about an inch to two inches up the hair shaft from the root. Let me show you how that actually works. If you have a quick look at the nozzle here, the nozzle is a direct nozzle, which means that the product is directed straight into the area where you point it, which is perfect for getting it all the way through, sectioning off the hair at the root area, and then utilizing blow drying with a round brush or blow drying with a vent brush to create more volume in the hair. This will create all of the lift that you need at that root area. And again, with that direction nozzle, very, very easy to use. Expander Volumizing Root Energizer. Next product in the styling line is our Elevate Volume Mousse. Um, one of the things we wanted to create with this new mousse was not a mousse that you'd see in late, maybe the late 70s, 80s, which was that very crispy, crunchy mousse. This is extremely different. This actually has Oregon oil in it, which is very important because the Oregon oil keeps the hair soft, keeps the hair movable and very pliable as well. But with the actual mousse in here and the polymers that we have, you get more hold and you get more manipulation of the hair when you're blow drying it, if you're scrunching the hair or whatever kind of movement and feeling you want to get through it and then literally use your hands like a rake and work it through the hair from the roots, mid lengths, all the way down to the ends and then blow dry the desired look that you want to work with. Again, not the kind of old fashioned mousse. You're not gonna get any crispy, crunchy feeling with this. You're gonna get a very soft, pliable, movable, finished look with this product. Creamy. Creamy paste is a thickening paste and it's got things in it like um, you'd find in here which would be kaolin which is a very very fine china clay and the way I would work with this is emphasizing areas that you want to have a little bit more definition in or a chunkier sort of a feeling maybe the ends of a haircut that you want to define the separation of a little bit more um, maybe the um, side areas that you want to get a little bit more movement through them and thickness in those side areas but again, work this through the hair when the hair's wet. Small amount goes a long way, but you'll get thickness from it. Little bit of hold, not much, but more thickness through this creamy paste. And the fourth product in the styling line is Blow and Set. And Blow and Set lotion is something that you put in your hair when your hair's wet, blow dry it through the hair, and then if you're using a curling iron, a flat iron to curl the hair, or even hot rollers to get a curl in the hair, this is the perfect product to put in to get that lovely set. Now, the hair's still gonna be movable, not really stiff, but it will hold that curl in perfectly. So remember, blow and set when your hair's wet, blow drying it through the hair to then curl afterwards. 
and that's our styling line which you use in the hair when the hair's wet and blow dry through. So now we're going to come to another one of our families which we call hybrid. Hybrid are products that you can work through hair when it's wet or when it's dry. So you've got obviously the balance of both, being able to use the same product for styling the hair and finishing the hair as well. First one we're going to come to is Beach Day. Main ingredient in this is magnesium. Perfect for that just loose, textured type of feeling that you might want, that, that beachy look, um, that sort of very defined, textured feeling that you can get, obviously after you've been at the beach all day long and you've just naturally dried your hair. Um, you can rough dry this with a blow dryer in the hair if you wish to. Quite nice to just spray through the hair and leave in. If you want a little bit more hold at the end, a little bit more separation and definition, spray this through the hair once the hair's dry as well. Beach day. Perfect for that separated beach look. Liquid volume. This is perfect for instant volume in the hair. Work it through the hair when the hair's wet, at the roots, through to the mid lengths, and then blow dry the hair, working it through. And then work with it at the end to putting it at the roots, mid lengths, to create more volume. Silica is one of the ingredients in here that really creates a lot more volume very, very quickly for you. Um, but again, working is through the hair when the hair is wet and when the hair is dry to create immense volume in the hair very, very quickly. Conundrum, another one of my favorites. Um, conundrum basically um, is a natural polymer in here, or we have natural polymers in here. And the reason it's called conundrum is because it's not a wax, it's not a paste, it's not a cream, it's all of them mixed together. For great manipulation of the hair when you want to create separation, definition, or really defining a certain area in the haircut. Maybe on a long layered haircut, you might spray booster through it, you might work with maybe some of the booster thickening cream, but on the very ends, you want to get more definition and separation. Conundrum's perfect for that as well. Short textured hair types too, um, basically working that through the hair and then drying through the hair. You'll get the definition from a cream, a paste, and then you'll have that slightly finished look that you'd get from a little bit of wax that you might want to put through on the ends. All in conundrum. Smooth and shine. This is a blend of Oregon oil and honey cream, which sounds very funny when you think of a honey cream and an Oregon oil mixed together. I know that most of our art directors that work with this product love to work with this product through processed hair. Hair that's been overly bleached maybe, highlighted intensely, high lift blondes, because what this does, it seals the cuticle down extremely quickly and creates a ton of shine in the hair and makes the hair a lot more manageable to work with. So if you're looking to smooth the hair out with intense shine, if the hair has been overprocessed, or you've got very coarse, thick hair, a perfect product for it. Working it through the hair when the hair's wet, or finishing with a small amount when the hair's dry as well. And then our Unite U Oil, which is our Oregon oil. It's Oregon-based product with the Oregon oil, obviously, that you work through the hair before you blow dry the hair. What this is gonna do is protect the hair, create a lot of shine in the hair, close the cuticle down quickly as well. But the nice thing about this Oregon oil too is you can work it through your hands once you've blow dried your hair and then work it through the hair. And you'll start to see a very, very increased shine, seal the cuticles down very quickly. And I would tend to, when the hair is dry, use this on the very tips and the very ends of the hair to make sure that they look a lot healthier and a lot shinier as well. Don't be worried about using this on finer or medium to fine hair. This will not weigh your hair down. And be sure to make it um, a point of getting even distribution when you put it through the hair. So when you put it in the hair when the hair is wet, Apply it to the hair with your hands, but then comb it through to get even distribution. And then once your hair's dry, if you want a little bit more shine and finish on the ends, use a small amount and just work it through the very ends of the hair to make sure it's finished a bit better. And that is our 
Oregon Oil, our U Oil from Unite. That is the hybrid collection that you would use on wet hair and dry hair as well. Another strong part of our line that you'll enjoy working with is our finishing products. It's probably why our finishing products are most used backstage at fashion shows and literally on magazine shoots because you can finish the hair perfectly with these products. Looking at the first product in the finishing line, we have Expander Dust. It's a volumizing powder that creates volume in the hair very, very quickly once the hair is dry. Ingredients in this that you're going to find are corn, potato and tapioca starch, um, along with basically kaolin, which you saw in our creamy, which is a thickening like powder. Um, it's probably the finest china clay that you can get. So expander dust literally comes out, you can tap it into the hair, literally just by using your finger and tapping down, so it literally falls down onto the root. Manipulate that through the roots and lift it up, or if you want to, you can actually use it like a puff powder, spraying it through the hair to create volume on all of the hair texture as well. But a fantastic product just to finish off to create more volume through the hair very, very easily. Second product that we have in the finishing line is our texturizing spray. It's a dry finishing texture spray. Now, what we usually think with a texture spray is a lot of definition and separation, but it has some wetness to it. This is absolutely 100% dry when you work it through the hair. How does this work? You literally hold it anywhere from seven to eight inches away from the hair, lift the hair and spray from the root, mid lengths all the way into the ends. And what you'll find is you'll create texture and volume all at the same time. Now, can you use this in place of a hairspray? Absolutely, if you want to, because what you're gonna get is not a great deal of hold, a small amount of hold, but lovely separation, definition and texture. Um, one of our most popular finishing products that we have in the line. So working with the two tricky sprays that we have, we have Tricky, which is a combination of hairspray and wax put in the hair. We found that sometimes when clients are finishing their hair, they don't want the complete hold of hairspray and that feeling of like the hair doesn't move. They wanted a little bit more separation and shine through the hair with hold. So what we did, we added 50% hairspray with 50% wax, like a wax finishing product with hold. And we came up with Tricky. Why Tricky Light? Tricky Light is the same amount of hairspray with half the amount of wax in it. So can you use it on finer hair? Absolutely. You'll get a little bit more hold with this without that full sort of wax feeling because we have literally pulled back on that wax a little bit more. So Tricky Light for not the intensity of the wax or for slightly finer hair. Second day, um, why was this product brought out? There's two reasons that we found that second day was needed. The first reason is when you get your hair blow dried for the first time, especially if you've got thicker, coarse hair and they've used a round brush to blow dry your hair to create a lot of volume and a lot of movement in the hair, sometimes you prefer your hair two or three hours later or maybe even the next day. So what we came up with is second day, which is a cream that you rub a small amount of it into the palms of your hands and then work it through your hair and it'll give you that second day look. How's this worked in another area? Well, we found that a lot of our session workers that were doing magazine work and that were doing photo shoots found that when models came along with perfectly clean shampooed hair, it was very hard to put that hair up, pin the hair, curl the hair or dress the hair. So once the hair has been freshly washed and blow dried, adding a small amount of second day through the hair will make it much easier for you to manipulate putting the hair up, curling the hair and especially pinning the hair as well. Now we have three hairsprays that complete the finishing of our line. Obviously all fixatives, all obviously sprays that would use at the very end of when you've finished styling your hair. Max Control is a stronghold hairspray, but it's also a working hairspray. 
We find that most hairdressers that work with this product like to spray it through the hair, manipulate the hair a little bit before it actually dries and sets, which gives you the time to be able to get your hair perfect before you actually set it and the hair holds. We then have Session Max, which is extra strong, extremely strong hairspray. Once you've sprayed this, you're done literally finished. So if you're going out in an evening and you don't want your hair to move, you really want your hair to stay in place, if you've created a chignon or a bun or some sort of style where you don't want the hair to really drop or fall, Session Max is absolutely perfect for you with that. And then we have the all-in-one hairspray which is Go365. Um, slightly different, it's three hairsprays in one. Let me show you how this works. We have a light, medium and strong hold and if you actually have a look inside where the nozzle is there, you can actually turn the nozzle to actually get the different strengths. How does this actually work? On the light hold, it's a small molecule of the product that will come out. Medium, slightly larger and then the strong hold or heavy hold is where a larger molecule of the product comes out which means you get more hold and more strength. This is the type of spray that you can use obviously throughout the day. In the morning you might want a light hold working into a heavier hold in the evening. But again, three strengths all in one with the Go365 hairspray. That's our finishing products. We believe that the finishing products are extremely important to just capture and finish the look that you've done with the styling and through the rest of the line. I'm not sure about you, but everyone here in the Unite family loves animals. We have doggy poo. Doggy poo is for your furry friends. It's literally a clean dog for a good cause. And when I say that, the profits from doggy poo, when you purchase them either online or purchase them in one of the salons where we actually sell this product, go to Shelter to Soldier and the Humane Society. What's so good about doggy poo? Well, apart from the charity and all of the great things that buying this shampoo for your dog will do, we have oatmeal for their skin. And oatmeal is a great property worked into the dog's coat, worked into its skin to help their skin with any irritation or anything that they might have that's discomforting for them. The other ingredient that we put in here was Oregon oil, which you will find in many of our Unite products for humans. Oregon oil is amazing for their coats, an incredible shine and luster that you'll see through your dog's coat after working with a shampoo. The other thing is, you have to smell it. The smell is amazing. After shampooing your dog with doggy poo, you're not going to get any wet dog fragrance, which we know isn't nice. You'll get the amazing fragrance of doggy poo. So, clean dog for a good cause, get doggy poo for your dog. So again, remembering three things that we haven't added as ingredients to our products, no sulfates, no paraben, and no sodium chloride. Everyone asks me, Dale, why do your products work so well? It's a very simple answer to that. At Unite, we use hairdressers to test our products. Myself, I've been a hairdresser for 40 years now, and I understand when I put a product in my hands, is this gonna perform the way we want it to perform? We don't have a marketing department that comes up with an idea that thinks, wow, this will be great for clients out there. That doesn't work for us. We literally have hairdressers working with our products, understanding what the client's needs are, and then creating a product for you to manipulate your hair and to get your hair looking amazing. That's why our products work so well and that's why we're number one. Seven seconds detangler, leave-in conditioner. If you're thinking about trying one of the Unite products, the first product I suggest that you try is our seven seconds leave-in conditioner. It's an amazing UV protector, thermal protector, and incredible for detangling the hair. Now, a couple of things to note about this. It's completely weightless. So it doesn't matter how fine your hair is, you can use this to detangle your hair and protect it as well. 
obviously with thick coarse hair perfect for that as well gets the tangles out very quickly and just gets your hair ready for styling and finishing so if you've never tried one of the unite products seven seconds leave-in conditioner will be the first one that you're going to try